This is Vince Reed, and I'm here with one of the uh, Pensbury big men, you might say. And of course, a man who was an uh, integral part of last year and hopes to be for this year and should be, and that's Mark Flagg. Mark, good to have you here. Thank you, dude. Good to be back. I'll tell you what, I mentioned to you just moments ago, yeah, I looked at you and I thought, I had to look up a little now. I got to really look up. You're yeah. about 6'9 now? Uh, yeah. Six, eight and a half, six, All right, very, very good. Yeah. Uh, tell me a little bit about, you know, your feeling about this team. Last year, uh, you know, you had a good season, and I'm sure you're looking to forward to even more, you know, this ball club. And, you know, last year maybe it didn't go as far as you had hoped, but uh, maybe the hopes are a little higher this year. Yeah, I think uh, this year is going to be a great year. A lot of guys worked real hard this uh, summer. We uh, auditioned with Billy Warren. He's going to help us out a lot, and I think we're going to make a lot of noise this year. Yeah, I was thinking about that because I was talking to Coach, and the way I was talking to him is that you've got three big guys mm. to be in the ball game at one time. That's going to be kind of unique for you. you. You've had another man big alongside you, but never had two as well as you. Yeah, especially big guys like Billy, Chad, or Mobile. I'm yeah. like, uh, and finish around the basket, around the floor. I love it. Uh, they're great players to play with. You know, you look at the, this season, of course, you, you've got some tough games coming up, and uh, Coach was telling me about you know, and I've seen the schedule that you really have some tough ones. Of course, that's exactly what you need, you, you know, to get ready for league play and really play your best in the league. you got to face that good competition. Yeah, Coach, Coach did it for us this year for playoffs. Last year, we had a early exit. This year, we're going to come out strong, beat the better teams. I think it's going to be good, though. You know, one of the things last year, you guys got on a roll, and I mentioned a, a lot of guys, because you had more experience, you had played more than the year before, but a lot of your guys were young. You were 7-0 and at one point, and I think one of the things, that, and, and I don't call it a collapse, but kind of going downhill a little bit, was the fact that, you know, you're young as they were, and it's a case of where they're thinking, oh, well, this game is easy. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, yes. the second half of the season, it wasn't easy, because some of those... Yeah. Those teams that you beat and beat soundly in the first half beat you in the second half. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that, that probably got into their heads and realized, you know, we, we got to keep it up good rather than think that we could take the floor against anybody, just beat them. Yeah, uh, we won a roll last year. We're, we're trying to get back to that mentality. We're trying to forget about what happened in the second half, but uh, I think we're going to go back out on it again this year. Big, nice roll. Well, I'll tell you what, the, the team coming back and what you've got, you know, now with the addition there of Warren coming in too. Uh, you got yourself a good ball club, and I think one of the things is, you know, you get the mindset you had when you started out last year. I think you guys really were enjoying playing. That's what it looked like. You really enjoyed the game. Mm -hmm. But then it started to get to you when you lost a couple of ball games. Yeah. Those younger kids, you know, maybe couldn't respond the way they you, you would expect them to. Yeah, uh, last year we were, we were pretty close, but this summer we, we yeah. got a pretty good bond this year. This time we're all like brothers now, so... I think the chemistry is going to be a lot better this year too. I figured with that year under your belt with these younger guys, and you know now you have it together, they know what now what it's going to take, and they realize that hey, if we don't do what we're supposed to do, we're going to be now early again. Yeah, and that's something you you don't want to see. So, but we're looking for a great season, and of course we're going to have all the games will be on the the TV because you'll be able to, even if you want to hook it up in your TV, I know some people who do that. You get them on the internet as well as the fact that you would listen to the ball games. You can watch uh, guys here. Of course, just, just like uh, here with Mark Flagg, you'll watch him. He's going, going to have himself a good season. What about college situation? Anything uh, that you can tell me about there? Uh, I received three offers this summer from the AU with Jerry Shores. I received offers from Holy Family, East Stroudsburg, and Westchester. And uh, I'm still getting recruited by a few Division One schools. They'll be out this year, but I'm going to work harder this year trying to get them. Well, I'll tell you what, the way I feel is that you have the year that I think you could have. There'll be a lot more of them coming in. Thank you. That's the luck to you. Can I be a fun season? Good. Thank you.